Yeah. Welcome <laughs> back to our channel. <laughs> well, hello. Welcome back to our channel. I'm Drew. I'm Chris. And we're the couple that does makeup together. Mm -hmm. But today, we have a special guest. Our best friend, Kate, is here. Hi! Mm -hmm. <laughs> we're going to give her an, a little transformation, her dream mm -hmm. transformation, if you will. Mm -hmm. So we're excited. We're going to turn her into a glam version of her, one of her favorite characters from her all-time favorite movie, and that's putting it lightly. Very lightly. lightly. <laughs> mm -hmm. From the Steven Spielberg film, Hook. 1991. Gonna, 1991. <laughs> we're going to turn her into Rufio. She become or, a Rufette. Rufia. 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 Thank you. Rufima. <laughs> Rufima. <laughs> Oh this God. sounds like a medicine. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Daily dose suffering? of Rufima. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> sounds like something for like rheumatoid arthritis. Oh my God. Rufima toid arthritis. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. I suffer. Okay. <laughs> okay. So today I think I'm going to be taking control of her mane. Giving her a nice, mane. nice look. Mm -hmm. Chris is going to handle her, the makeup department. I'll beat the face. <laughs> You'll beat my face? <laughs> So if you want to hang out with all of us today, keep on watching. All right, so I'm going to go in with the NYX Bear With Me Jelly Primer. Ooh, This is my favorite primer so far. It has a jelly-like texture. Sticky. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Oh my god, did, did it? it? Oh. <laughs> did it we're, we're priming Kate's breasts with <laughs> the Bare Minerals. Jesus. No, it's NYX. <laughs> uh, I mean, you always want to moisturize before you do makeup so that your skin is nice I didn't and moisturize. supple. moisturize. Doesn't it feel nice? It's quite nice, yes. Mm -hmm. It'd be nicer if it wasn't in my mouth. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Where's where it at? Adjust yourself. Uh. Adjust yourself. <laughs> Adjust yourself. <laughs> so, okay, tell us a little bit about your... My obsession? Your obsession with... The movie Hook. Because when I say it's her all-time favorite movie, it's That's definitely putting it extremely mildly. lightly. Tell us a little about like, your obsession with Hook. Well, uh, it came out the same year that I did, 1991. <laughs> <laughs> out of the womb. And it's, I've been watching it since I was probably two years old. I think we bought it on VHS probably around then. And I have watched it incessantly ever since then but yeah it's i have the best friends in the world because they put <laughs> up with me talking about it incessantly like a lot they put up with me talking about it a lot a lot all right starting with the brows I do a really nice structured brow very clean i should say I have a general idea of what the makeup looks going to be like. I have no idea what Drew's doing. <laughs> no clue at all. Where? I'm a little scared. I'm losing everything <laughs> in my mind. Uh, what? You're pulling my hair. So sorry. You're not sorry. You enjoy causing me pain. <laughs> Never. Never. Lies. I'm going in with the Morphe Brow Cream in the shade Java, which isn't a bad color for her, but I wouldn't say it is dark. her color. Yeah, it's, she a little, she a little deep. Sorry, right. <laughs> sorry. Right. As we're doing this on another person, this is gonna be interesting. I feel like least. Katniss Everdeen, <laughs> my prep team. The girl. The girl. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Where? Not in these brows. <laughs> what? Should I talk about my tattoo? <laughs> oh, yeah. Little girl. Well, ask me about it. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's make it natural. <laughs> oh, my Lord. So, tell us about, don't you have a tattoo? <laughs> <laughs> so natural. Uh, I don't know if I can, Drew, you're going to have to. It's okay. How far does your obsession with Hook go? Do you have any, like... Body modification. <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> yes, I've uh, allowed myself the ability to fly. <laughs> oh, yes, honey. No. I have one and only one tattoo, and it is the second star to the right. And straight on till morning. Oh, yes. So for anyone that hasn't seen Hook, and I feel like 
You think no one has seen Hook, but I feel like a lot of people actually like know about Hook. Yeah. Well, the only reason I feel like that is because I'm the only one that I know of that loves it as much as I do. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah, I feel like a lot of people have seen it. It's a really big childhood classic. Mm -hmm. You know. Mm -hmm. Indeed. So yeah, tell us a little bit about the plot. Well, basically, it's the story of Peter Pan, but he grows up, and he essentially becomes what all grown-ups are destined to become. He becomes this, like, really strict businessman, has no time for, like, his family or fun, but he goes to London to visit Granny Wendy. She's an old bat now. (laughs) But while he's there, his kids get kidnapped by Hook, and he has to go to Neverland and save them and rediscover who he is as Peter Pan. So, my favorite story. (laughs) Now the brows are done. I'm going to go with Conceal and Define, Full Coverage, Foundation by Makeup Profusion. (laughs) What's that now? I'm just going to... (laughs) <laughs> Milk Draw a face. <laughs> I'm a ghost. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, I am. Nah. I'm well aware of how pasty I am. <laughs> the sun and I are not friends. <laughs> Between being stabbed in the face with a sponge and my hair being yanked out. That's <laughs> the price of beauty. Yeah, the price of beauty, girl. Dante Bosco, I don't know how you did it. <laughs> Dante, if you're watching, Kate wants a meet and greet. Another personal one. mean greed. Mm-hmm. Not personal. One on one. Talk about. I she, she would pick his brain. I would. She could spend an afternoon yes. with him. An afternoon? I could spend a whole week, I'm sure. She's just like picking his brain about every little. Every single detail. I have so the, many questions. The, mm-hmm. uh, uh. <laughs> Phase two. Phase two. How many phases are there? <laughs> Gonna start carving out some contour. My face feels good, but my head hurts a lot. <laughs> Oof. Buff out that contour, soften that line. Buff it out, oh, oh, buff it. You've never seen holes. I have, but it's usually in the compact holes. mirror. Oh my god. Must you? The bow. <laughs> Let's keep it clean for the children. <laughs> Shut that smile up. Shut that snout. Trunk. Uh, uh, <laughs> Trunk. <laughs> They're always like this to me. Always. No. <laughs> she always is out to make us the villain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> because they are. <laughs> the the reason that inspired this look, uh, Dante Bosco is coming out with a book called From Rufio to Zuko. And just to remind everyone, Dante Bosco is, is Rufio. the actor. Who played the actor. Mm-hmm. Um, and he also played, was. Zuko. He was also the voice of Zuko on Avatar The Last Airbender. But he's coming out with that book, and it's coming out in November. And if he does a book tour, I was hoping that I could do... Well, if, by some miracle, if he does a book tour and comes to Portland, then I was hoping that I could use this look and go and meet him oh, yes. again. Right, I'm going to bronze with some Vizashin's formula. What shade are you using? Light bronzer. So is that mine? Yep. <laughs> well, I mean, like, my shade. Because I'm so dumb that I accidentally bought a shade worthy of Chris. <laughs> I was like, look at me buying this on my own. <laughs> That's what happens when I buy things on my own. <laughs> I could talk about the boat mirror if you want. Oh, my God. The first summer that we moved here, it was so hot somehow that it melted <laughs> the... Damn. What? What? Don't get your hair. <laughs> the first summer that we moved here... It was so hot that it melted the rear view mirror off of my car. We were mirrorless for quite some time. And he went home to visit his family. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to buy, I'll buy it. I know that there's suction cup mirrors that you can buy online. And so I bought one. So it got shipped to me and it was this giant ass mirror. Like it was, God, it was so ridiculous. I don't even know how to compare what it looked like. It almost it looked, looked like, like a boat mirror. It was it was a boat mirror and it almost looked like a small picture frame, but it worked. And I was like, what is this? <laughs> he was pissed. When I got the car. Is this her up here? Mm-hmm. God. What? I'm a baby. He's yanking on my hair and I'm a baby. <laughs> <laughs> She's kind of like, I don't know, like 
sexy, like, sex. <laughs> Goddess. I'm using this light shade to kind of help bring out the high lines. This feels very color. strange. I won't look because I won't cheat. <laughs> so I'm gonna go into the Morphe 25L and start carving out the look that he has, which is kind of weird. It's because... his battle look. Yeah, because his like brows are like way closer, so they can go straight down at his like mm -hmm. nose. But your eyebrows are like a little bit farther, so they're not gonna be straight up and down as graphics. So I don't know how. Just make it work, girl. Make it work! What do you plan on doing, like, in the future? Since... I think we touched on, like, obviously film. It's kind of a bigger part of your life. Like, as a career? Yeah. Oh. Well... Like, what, are your, what is your goal? I'm currently studying film and media studies. But my end goal, I really want to shoot B-roll footage, which is the things that you see on the, like, special features. So it's all the behind-the-scenes work. Because that's really what inspired me to get into film anyway. So I'm adding a little bit of Red to Kate's hair. Hear her. Just looking at your gloss job. My bonnet. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Kate's gonna see herself. For the first time. time in years. Oh my god. You see, like, your, it's like a faux hawk. I can't really it's see huge. no. huge. Oh my god. Right? That's awesome. Oh my god. You can look at it and you like, yeah. yeah. Oh my god, my hair is huge! <laughs> Just... Oh dang! Isn't that big? Yes, girl. Isn't that nice? Nice and big! Oh my god. Bang a ring! Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yep, honey. Yes. Gave her a big structured bohawk moment. A little bit of red in the front. Mm -hmm. A hint at Rufio's red hair. Mm -hmm. A really like smoky, like red eyeliner, and like really like black. So it's kind of like a beak. <laughs> a beak. Yep. A beak. I feel like that's kind of like. A beak. Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. What do you think of the look, girl? I love it. Mm. It's my true, true dream coming to life. They're gonna say yeah. it's my true form. <laughs> my, <laughs> I've my achieved true. my final <laughs> form. I hear like a Pokemon evolution, like. Dun, 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 dun. If any of you says this here Skug ain't Peter Pan, cross the line. So that wraps up this week's video. If you like what you saw, you can go ahead subscribe, comment, share, do all the fun things. All right, we will see you next Monday at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. Bye.